Good afternoon, Planet YouTube. It is 12.24 on the afternoon of April 1st. Happy April, happy spring, happy April Fools, whatever it is you do today. If you do anything special, some people do for April Fools. I don't. My daughter's already warned me that there might be a couple of funny posts about her and her boyfriend going up and to not panic. So I was like, hmm. Right, this is the last time we'll be seeing the binder because we are moving into back into Poppins, um, which we'll see in a minute. Right, um, I think I did the word. I, I did go back. I know I missed quite a lot out last night. Um, I had a pounding headache and I just I just wanted to get to bed, you know. And I slept so well that one of my kids came round to talk to the son that I live with, and I didn't even hear anything. I feel a bit guilty about, but then you know, I was also like, well, you, you two didn't come wake me up, so <laughs> um, we've done that. Step. That's that done. I did all that before I went to bed and marked it off. I've done the weather yet. Yeah, DLS stands for Dirty Little Secret, which is the band that my friend plays in. Um, I think my word for Sunday, because I know I haven't put it in, is going to be rest, because I needed it after dancing my socks off. Saturday night. Okay, I also did a little bit of journaling just to finish it off. And that's March done, really, I think, isn't it? Oh, I didn't finish off the Jashi Corin, um, Jashi Corin ones. Um, I haven't yet picked my challenges for April either. So I'm going to have to um, um, what's the word I'm looking for? I'm going to have to go on a hunt a bit later on. Uh, I can't even tell you how far I got. Did, you, did I do Uranus? I've only got Neptune and Pluto to go, I believe. Two, three, four. No, Uranus, Neptune and Pluto. Okay, let's have a quick look up and see what they are. Planet. Oh, I can spell symbols. Right. So that's Uranus there. So twenty fifth was Mars, which is that one. Then it should have been autumn, which was the leaf. That's the one I'm missing. One, two, three, four, five. Yes, yeah, so I just need Neptune and Pluto. Okay, so uh, let's use that pen. Neptune sort of goes like that. Oops, it's a bit wonky. Okay, that's Neptune. I don't even know if Pluto's going to be on her. Hmm. No, it's not. So I've got mine about Pluto. There you go. Because it's a planetoid, isn't it? Now, not a planet. So it's a sort of. Like that. There you go. So we are done. That is March finished. This doesn't look too bad. I needed to do more in a way of pulling cards. I need to do that today as well. Back on the tracker. So. 
Oh, I need to catch up with greys. Good thing I did that then, wouldn't it? Otherwise I wouldn't have seen that. Yeah, really pleased with how this has turned out. That's the play tent we got when we went to Southampton. I love that little door I drew. Well pleased with that. I've got the sprocket. We are back in my poppings. Yay! Okay, so the way I've got it set out is this is my future log, this book. This will be my future log completely. So I will try and keep the month up to date as well as just writing things in here. So I'll just find out my mother actually has an appointment tomorrow, which she's put in the Google Calendar and I didn't even notice. So I'm going to put it there first at 12 p.m. So this will be each year, and I will do it the same as this each year. So each year will be a double spread. And then, well, it's tomorrow. And then I will have my monthly, okay? And all of my monthly stuff will be in here. And then I will have my weeklies. Like so. And then at the end of my weeklies, I will have my dailies. I've got all of my trackers. This is going to be my weather tracker. My regular tracker, which I still haven't yet filled in card of the day we'll do that in a minute guys i'll have to do this a bit later because i've already eaten so yeah i kind of feel a bit uh, shit my plane and my mood trackers sleep steps my regular cleaning tracker which i'm going to mix that up a little bit next week uh, next month but that'll stick for now i've also done like a template of my day so like the blue is my morning routine which involves getting up getting daryl some breakfast um I've written social media. What I mean by that is checking YouTube for any comments because, you know, you know, I demand comments off of you lot. Um, it's also to check. Um, I admin a couple of groups. I'm captain of a Fitbit team. It's to check stuff like that. Some weeks I can let it fly until the Friday and do it all on the Friday night. Other weeks, each day is quite like intense and requires a lot in the way of scoring and checking and all that shit. So some days I do that in the morning. Sometimes it won't. Pardon me, it won't be until the evening. Brush teeth, clean the loo, get dressed, sort out Daryl's lunchbox and get Daryl to school. Those are Monday, Tuesday and Wednesdays only because he, that's when he goes to preschool. Then I come home and it's filmed today in my bujo, um, do any chores and then catch a bus at 10.40 if I want to go for my walk. Tuesdays, Stuart has an appointment um, at 10 o'clock, so I meet him for that. He's not going tomorrow, so I'm free tomorrow for that. Um, again, filmed today in my bujo. Because I meet Stuart at 10, I don't have time to do to tame my boo just so that gets relegated till after I've picked up Daryl. Um, I go down and clean the big house, number 53, and I take my mum out. This is collecting Daryl from preschool. Do any undone chores. Set up uh, my Fitbit for the weekend. And then 7.30pm I go live. I don't do anything regularly on a Thursday. 
Um, I've been visiting my daughter the last couple of Thursdays, and I might make that a weekly thing. I might relegate it to once a month. I'm not sure. She only lives like five miles away. It's not a huge thing, but it's a day out. We catch the train, and it is lots of good fun. Um, Friday, I've got to set up another thing for the weekend. It's usually date night. Saturdays, I don't do anything regular. Sundays, I've got to check all the scoring for my Fitbit team, and Amanda goes live. So, you know, I just thought that was a good at a glance, if you like. And then we did week, week 14. So I think I might go in with a white, a white pen to accent that. I don't know. I mean, it's quite easy for me to read. It's not that easy for you guys on camera, is it? I don't know. You have to let me know. Um... This week's challenge for Fitbit is called April Follies. The woman who created it is also called April. <laughs> um, tomorrow the 100 day challenge starts and that's going to be a Zentangle thing. Um, I'll stick a link up to the cards for a video explaining what we're doing and how we're doing it. Um, Amanda over at Ele Eclectic Scribbles uh, is running it. So yeah, and that's what we're doing. And then I've set aside you know, a few pages for um, this week next week we can't and then i should have enough in there to do a page a day if i want to and see where my glue is all leaked through and the ink is all leaked through because <laughs> i fucked that up in the life but there we go that's fine um then i've got a book for may and a book for june already set up this has got tom away paper in it the other two books don't so i may swap these and try this next month but just curious to see what it's gonna how it's gonna lot you know because i'm curious the difference in thickness is amazing so yeah i just like to be in up ahead and then i've also got this booklet that i made not that long ago um this is a link up to that this is a napkin covered booklet this is quite cool it's napkin decoupage it's my first ever go and this is going to be my collections for 2019 um, I think I might make like a little sticker to go on the front. I'm sure I've got a tag punch or something that we can make it pretty with. Um, so here we've got my resolutions. This is washi here and here. So 2019 resolutions. So I've set that up. This is my penny a day. And then I thought over here I'd put my progress. I'm a bit pissed off with how this is turning out because it doesn't look quite right. So I may end up colouring it in. I don't know because I don't like it. It looks a bit naff. This is going to be gifts ideas. This is going to be films that I've watched. I just need to fill it all in. I might do a double spread for that. I'm not sure. I mean, how many new films a year do you really watch? Don't know. And then I'm going to need three pages for my year in photos. But then that only takes me to half through, halfway through the book. Um, I did write a list. Yeah, and that's it. So this might end up actually being next year's book as well, if that is all that I fill up. So I say, if I make that a single page, then I can do year in photos there, there and there. And then I could start 2020's resolutions here and do the whole thing again. Hmm, we might, we'll have to see on that one. And... Um, that one is going to go in here. I just took it out while I was drawing the trapper boards yesterday. So there you go. That's how that's going to go. So anyway, it's time to change the pen. And let's get started. That says embrace mistakes there on a little um, post-it that I glued in because i screwed up this was always going to be my monthly calendar but i drew two calendars and didn't realize and i wrote the weather there and it wasn't supposed to be the weather was always supposed to be here so i just thought bollocks you know what i'm going to stick a sticky over it and it, it works okay that's fine okay so the weather for today is um weather 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 Nice and sunny with a wee bit of cloud. Hmm. Let's use that one. And because I'm really, really crap 
at drawing suns, I am going to cheat. I'll just have a little bit of cloud. Poking out. I'm also going to put time up here. That's sunrise. Sunset. And 13 degrees. I might colour it in a bit later. I don't know. I haven't decided. <laughs> I really haven't decided. I might write weather along there later. Um, trackers. Yeah. I need to write that in. Um, see a bit of pencil. Yeah, I'm going to come back and do that in a minute. Card of the day. Let's do the card of the day. We use 606. For the everyday witch tarot. Page of Swords. The pages often represent a younger person or a child. Um, I'm pretty sure I know who this is actually pointing towards at the moment. Um, you know, or, or somebody you feel responsible for. So it might not be a young person or a child, but it might be your child or somebody that you've helped look after or something like that. Um, it indicates a mixture of enthusiasm but also uncertainty but there is a determination to follow it right through to the end no matter where it goes the idea is, is to follow the idea because it appeals to you intellectually rather than emotionally um and there is such a thing as being too smart for your own good i'm pretty sure this is talking about my second son he's just quit a job to get another job so it wasn't an impulsive thing he came he spoke to me he asked my advice he asked the advice of his brother and said you know what do you think i should do he wasn't happy where i was it was fucking with his head so you know we said to him look do you want to go because it's about more money is it about more hours because he doesn't always get good hours and he said well that's part of it mum you know but blah 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 so we spoke and 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 that's what it's basically come down to and today he thought about it overnight and he's made the decision and he's handed in his notice so there you go right Okay, what I've done is put um, Page of Swords, a young person, question Matt, a new start, maybe impulsive but determined, and then I've written in very, very small, Matt left his job today. So there we go, that's that one. 
Uh, can't do that. I'll do that later, and I will do that later as well. You know, after I've been to the toilet or something. <laughs> Sleep. Sleep last night was quite good, I think. 11.45 until 7.30. Nobody wanted to get up this morning. It was great. Oh, I've done that the wrong way around. I've done the numbers going upwards. Why did I do that? That's weird. Why have I done that? I will fix that. I didn't even notice. What did I say? 11.30. Till 7.30 or thereabouts. I wonder why I filled that in backwards. I, it, I set this up during my live, that might have been why. And I must have been heavily asleep because, like I say, he came around last night and I didn't even hear him. I found out this morning. <laughs> I said to my other son, why did you wake me up? He said, well, I thought about it, Mum, but you were fast asleep. There we go. Oh, I can't believe I did that. I didn't even notice. Okay, so far today I have cleaned the loo and done the laundry. Um, that'll do tomorrow when I see him. I'll do that in a bit. I've also got to bring forward the things that I haven't done from the end of last week. So, which was cool housing, and then wrong blue. Yeah, sorry, I'm trying to find the right blue because I colour code, don't I? I look into a stickable track of Brittany. Stickable, not slickable. And then, oops. General is drop off the bottle tops. there to remind me that I need to check that and get it sorted okay so that makes that the 8th that's the 15th that's the 22nd and that's the 29th should mean I should have enough in here I'm just going to triple check one two three four Five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty, twenty, twenty-two, twenty-four, twenty-six, twenty-seven, twenty-eight, twenty-nine, thirty two left over Ooh, that's a good uh, relief look at that that's fucking pulled really bad there oh well okay so let's start today it is the first today so we'll start with that one And I quite like the look of that blue, so we're going to have that blue today. Ooh. Don't even 
even know what that blue is yet. <laughs> Let's have a look, what's it called? <gasps> Pardon me, oh, Nebula. That sounds nice, doesn't it? There we go. That's a nice colour. Okay, so that's me set of the day. I'm going to go and... Um, I'm just going to chuck that there so I know what page I'm on. Um, I'm going to go and... Uh, you know, do my day. <laughs> Let's do this quickly. And, uh, yeah, get some chores done and general sort of things. All the things that I need to do to get my day done. Um, I'm trying to think of ways to be more artistic on a page. So today, there's not going to be a lot happening. This is a normal Monday. I'm not going out. So there's not going to be photos. But, like, my son left his job and I want to put that in bigger writing. Now, Matt is blue ordinarily. Okay. Sandringham is the name of the hotel. <laughs> right. So, so far today, I need to um, sort out my tracker write down what I want to put in here and do my measurements okay so let's put those on my weekly I might put another paper clip on there just so I know where I am that needs to go in today doesn't it really take measurements sort Tracker list. There you go. Yeah. That's that then. Right. I am going to go on and get ahead with my day. And I will see you all for the evening edition. I hope you're having a fantastic day. See you tonight. Bye. Good evening. Um, I'm trying something a little bit new and I want you to tell me how the sound is. Hopefully you can hear me okay and it's nice and clear and you haven't got that odd background shit going on. Uh, I've borrowed my son's streaming headset, which is what this cable is. It's not got a horrendously long cable and I'm terrified I'm going to pull it off my head or something. So <laughs> but if this is something I can cope with, then um, getting a headset is something I could look into doing. So I spent the day catching up on a few things. I'm doing my film uh, films I've watched in 2019. I've got to draw little stars under each one. I'm not very good at drawing stars. But let's get on with the day. I coloured it in with pencil. This is just here to stop the pencil transferring when I write on it. And I've filled in my task list. So, so far today, I have done my challenges. Oops. Did you all have a good Monday? Um, I didn't wear makeup, I've got to do challenges. I haven't had any alcohol. But I have had fizzy and caffeine because it was Dr. Pepper. Had chips too. Did I craft? See, I've changed that from 60 minutes craft to did you craft? No, I didn't. <laughs> so there you go. Fail. <laughs> But I have stepped shitloads today, so. Um, haven't taken my measurements. Right, let's do my mood and pain levels. 
that's my pencil, not my pen. Duh. Pen. Um, ruler. I'd say I don't actually need my ruler for this bit. I'd say my mood is probably there. Well, my pain isn't too bad today, so I'm going to put that there. Which is why I've stepped loads, because I've actually felt quite good. Well, I'll fill the steps in tomorrow. Right. I have picked up around my office. I have done the lounge window. I've done the TV. Yay me. Um, I haven't done the rest yet, so I shall do those in a moment. Um, I shall have to do those tomorrow because I haven't done those yet. I have done Stuart's form. So let's colour that in. Uh, and I sorted my tracker list out. Good, 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 good. Uh, that's been cancelled. Right, and then we're going to jump forward to today. I found myself a couple of challenges when I locate my phone. Ah, there it is. <laughs> so the challenges I've chosen to do are... The April Doodle Challenge, it looks like this cute little Easter basket, by Doodle with Andrea. Oh no, that's hashtag Doodle with Andrea. By the Paper Tea Party. Is that Paper Dot Tea Party? Yeah, it's a dot between each one, so Paper Dot Tea Dot Party. It's there, look, for God's sake. <laughs> um, I'm doing April's Better Your Letters by Letter Ella. E W L A H. Um, that's my one of my lettering challenges and my other doodle challenge is um, the TPPB doodles by Shells Bujo and these are going to be spring flowers so I've got to do tulip and rain and the words hello April which is you know quite good so I also need to write in that it's Monday today So I'm going to do that with the thick end, I think. Monday. Okie dokie. Right. I want... What do I want? What do I want? What do I want? I want a small Faber-Castell. Hello, April. <laughs> All right, we'll do a few more little green 
some drops. I think that would do, don't you? Yeah, I think that would do very nicely. I have tulips, hello April, and rain for that, which is cool. Um, so I can now. I can find it. <laughs> Where's my tracker? Oh my word. I'm not used to the order in which I've done everything in here. It's there, for goodness sake. Right, so I can now put in that I've done the challenges. Ah. Right, I think that's about it for today. Um, not really much more I can do. I should do a little bit of journaling there. Um, quite like that with the raindrop. So this was done um, with the classics Prima. The green was done with W. H. Smith's watercolors. The rain was done with the Kurataki pearl colors. That was done with Kelly Creates small brush pen. That was done with a ink joy gel pen. So yeah, there we go. Other things I have done today is I've drawn out, I think I've already said, drawn that. I've just got to draw stars underneath each one and then I will colour them in. For example, three films that I've watched so far this year, I watched um, Real Player One, Ready Player One. Uh, the Great Showman and today I've just watched um, Skyscraper. Three really good films, enjoyed all, all three of them. Um, so yeah, so that works out about a film a month so I reckon that should be enough because I've got 16 there. So I shall now start my year in photos on here which then does give me that extra page at the end of the first half in case I think of anything else that I need to put in here. And then I could just do 2020 in this book as well, which would work out really, really cool if I do the same collections all the way through. So I could even be really like snazzy and like flip it so that I haven't got to flip through half the book every time. I don't know. We'll see. We'll see. Um, let me jump out and slip in that. It's because I haven't got a book on the other side of it, I think. Um, yeah, like I said, this is my um, future log. So there we go. Yeah, I'm quite pleased with how this has turned out so far. Looking forward to starting the 100 day challenge tomorrow. That would be good. I can't remember what bins go out this week. I'll have to look that up and make sure I stamp my monthly actually so that I know for the rest of the month I normally do a stamp down there so anyway right that's it um could you please leave a comment down below and let me know whether you thought the sound on the second half was better because um if it is I'm either gonna have to make a point of stealing this every time I do a um recording <laughs> which means I can't record in the afternoon then because he's using it or, and um, steal it for the lives or I'm gonna have to get one and I don't know how much it was but it, knowing him it was probably quite expensive and he hasn't got a spare which is a bit of a bummer so there we go yeah um, yeah let me know whether you thought this was any better there wasn't that background sort of noise um, or whether you know it's not really that much different Sam don't worry about it whatever um, please feel free to give this video a thumbs up um, leave me a comment you can just just say hi that's that's sufficient i love it I, I love people who talk to me um but yeah i do love comments it's 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 nice to wake up and see your comments in the morning i hope everybody is well um if you hit the book you'll be subscribed and if you hit the bell youtube willing you'll be updated when i upload new content i hope you had a fantastic 
1st of April and that nobody played any stupid silly pranks on you. Thankfully nobody did on me, but there we go. <laughs> I don't think anybody's brave enough. Not anymore. <laughs> so, um, yeah. Take it easy, guys, and I will see you tomorrow for tomorrow's edition of Today in My Bujo. Have a good one. Bye.